Join me as I dive into the mind of a math genius who surprisingly snagged a Nobel Prize in literature, can I figure out how they did it? Today we're going to talk about a truly exceptional individual who achieved the rare feat of blending mathematical genius with literary mastery. This person's story is fascinating, and I'm excited to share it with you. Reconciling the worlds of mathematics and literature is no easy task. These two fields are often seen as vastly different, with math being about logic and precision, and literature being about creativity and imagination. How can someone excel in both? It's a challenge that few have attempted, and even fewer have succeeded in. Our math genius, however, not only excelled in both but also managed to merge them in a way that's both beautiful and groundbreaking. Their work defies categorization, existing at the intersection of mathematical precision and literary creativity. It's a place where equations meet poetry, and theorems become narratives. This unique blend of talents allows them to approach problems from multiple angles, finding innovative solutions that others might have overlooked. The implications of their work are far-reaching, with the potential to inspire new ways of thinking across multiple disciplines. By combining the logical rigor of mathematics with the creative freedom of literature, they've opened up new avenues of exploration and discovery. Despite the many challenges, our math genius has managed to find a way to bridge the gap between these two seemingly disparate worlds. Their work is a testament to the power of interdisciplinary thinking and the boundless potential of the human mind. Bertrand Russell, a renowned philosopher and logician, is our math genius. Born in 1872, Russell was a child prodigy who demonstrated exceptional mathematical abilities from an early age. He went on to make significant contributions to the field of mathematics, particularly in the areas of logic and set theory. His work on Russell's paradox, a famous problem in set theory, is still studied by mathematicians today. He also made substantial contributions to the development of modern logic, which has had a profound impact on the fields of computer science, artificial intelligence, and philosophy. But Russell was more than just a mathematician. He was also a prolific writer, penning numerous books on philosophy, politics, and literature. His writing style was characterized by its clarity, precision, and logical rigor, qualities that he developed through his mathematical pursuits. In 1950, Russell was awarded the Nobel Prize in Literature, a recognition of his contributions to philosophy, particularly his advocacy for peaceful resolution and international cooperation. His Nobel lecture, titled What Desires Are Politically Important? is a testament to his ability to apply mathematical logic to real-world problems. The Nobel Prize was a culmination of Russell's life's work, which had taken him from the heights of mathematical abstraction to the depths of human experience. His recognition marked a turning point in the history of interdisciplinary thought, demonstrating that mathematical genius and literary flair are not mutually exclusive, but complementary aspects of human creativity. Today, Russell's legacy continues to inspire new generations of thinkers, writers, and mathematicians. He remains a towering figure in the history of philosophy and mathematics, a testament to the power of human ingenuity and creativity. So, what do you think about the intersection of math and literature? Can you imagine a world where these two disciplines blend together seamlessly? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to check out my other videos for more intriguing stories.